welcome students in this video we are going to discuss the fifth part of number series i am mohit kumar i have done my masters of technology from iit bhuvneshwar by profession i am assistant professor in iter shiksha o anushandhan university odisha i am also an educator on an academic platform i am an unacademic category expert for math section in banking examination what do i mean by an academic category expert is that i will be providing you with all the videos of all important topics which are asked in both banking po as well as banking clerk examination in math section so if you want to receive notification about my videos about my lectures whenever i upload them on your email id or on an academy app then do follow me at this login id user id so let us start today's video in today's video we are going to discuss one of the most important type of number series problem multiplied by a plus minus b type format so in this type of formats the consecutive numbers are related by two factors by two parameters a multiplicative parameter and an additive parameter a and b so since these are the most important and frequently asked type question so these questions are not easy you require to gain a lots of practice you require to do a lot of practice to solve this question within stipulated amount of time but yes these question can be solved if you do proper amount of practice so for these videos for this topic only we will make two video on this topic itself on this type itself okay so this is the first part of the video in the next part we will continue this type now how can we say that the particular problem belongs to this question there is a simple rule in this type of question in the beginning the difference between the consecutive number is quite small for example 2 to 3 difference will be between the first number and the second number however once the series progresses the fifth and sixth number will have quite large difference why it will be large difference because multiplication is done there so automatically the difference will be large so how should we solve this question in for solving this question first of all you should try to find the multiplicative parameter a once the multiplicative parameter a is found you can easily found the additive parameter so first of all try to find the multiplicative parameter from the last numbers or from the first numbers which from whichever you can find it the multiplicative parameter should be consistent along all the rules basically these type of questions can be classified into four categories so what are those categories the first category is when the multiplicative and additive parameters a is equal to b what do i mean by this it will be explained quite easily it can be understood quite easily when i explain some question but since it is classification so let us try to understand here the first and second number as well as the second and third number as well as the third and fourth number will have same multiplicative and additive parameter for example it will be into 2 plus 2 the second category in which the multiplicative parameter a is increasing but the additive parameter b is same for example the first and second number will be related by the formula multiplied by 1 minus 2 the second and third will be related by the formula multiplied by 2 minus 2 see the multiplicative factor is increasing the third category is in is in which both the multiplicative as well as additive parameter is increasing it is again subclassified into two categories first when a equal to b and second when a is not equal to b when a equal to b then the first and second will be related multiplied by 1 plus 1 second and third will be related multiplied by 2 plus 2 and so on some similar kind of formulas will be utilized when a is not equal to b then it they will be related such as into 2 plus 2 into 1 plus 2 then into 2 plus 3 then into 3 plus 4 in such pattern there is a mistake here it should be into 2 plus 3 
there is one more important category in which both the multiplicative and additive parameter a and b are decreasing and a and b are not equal for example the first and second are related as multiplied by 6 plus 5 the second and third are related as multiplied by 5 plus 4 and so on various apart from these four categories numer questions can be asked from miscellaneous categories also for example some questions are asked on when a is increasing and b is decreasing or when both a and b are increasing but the sign of b alternately changes from plus to minus we will discuss we will also discuss few problems based on these types but these types are hard to decode when in under the exam pressure so basically you should try to focus in solving questions based on these four categories okay so let us start the first question what we are going to solve was asked in SBI clerk means 2016 the numbers are 286 142 x 34 16 and 7 okay as you can see that the difference in the initial part of the series is quite small as compared to the difference in the final part of the series so one thing is sure there will be some multiplicative factor okay now what will be the multiplicative factor which we have to find first see 7 into 2 equal to 14 similarly 142 into 2 equal to 284 so yes 2 can be multiplicative factor so if i make a series 7 into 2 so it will be 7 into 2 14 plus 2 equal to 16 the additive factor is coming to be plus 2 let us find the relation between second and third element 16 and 34 16 into 2 is equal to 32 plus 2 equal to 34 yes it is following the rule between these two elements 142 into 2 is equal to 284 plus 2 equal to 286 yes it is also following the rule so we can conclude that the relation between 34 and x will also be multiplied by 2 plus 2 which will give 34 into 2 68 plus 2 equal to 70 the value of x is equal to 70 you can verify the rule how can you verify the rule by checking 70 into 2 plus 2 is equal to 142 yes it is also following the rule based on this pattern you should solve one more question okay so what you should do you should pause the video right now and you should try to solve this question mark the question in this video we will give you seven questions so what you should do corresponding to question number one what is your answer corresponding to question number two what is your answer you should mark these are the practice question and at the end of the video you should give your solutions in the comment box i will verify whether it is correct or not and if you are facing difficulty in any particular question then you can ask i will tell you what is the logic behind that question let us go to the next question which was asked in ibps rrbpo 2015 the links are the numbers are 8 5 5.5 8.5 23 89.5 and x as you can see here here the difference is negative then again the difference is increasing now students generally confuse this with mixed type question okay remember in mixed type question what we studied that the number should be alternatively increasing and decreasing look here the it is decreasing then it is increasing but after this it is after this it is increasing only it is not decreasing so it is not mixed type question okay so how can we solve this as you can see it that the difference here is quite large as compared to the difference in the lower half so yes it can be type 5 question so how what can be the logic from the up outer half i can say that it will be something 23 into 4 because 23 into 4 is equal to 92 so 92 minus 2.5 it can be something like that so let us try to find the logic so if i find the logic 8 into 1 minus 2.5 i will get 5.5 5.5 into 2 into 2.5 i will get 8.5 8.5 into 3 minus 2.5 i will get 23 and 23 into 4 minus 2.5 i will get 89.5 so what can I conclude is that the multiplicative factor is increasing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 whereas the additive factor is 
constant minus 2.5 minus 2.5 minus 2.5 so our result will be increment to the multiplicative factor from 4 to 5 and same additive factor which is negative in this case minus 2.5 5. So the value of x will be 89.5 multiplied by 5 minus 2.5 which comes to be 445. Based on this question you should try this question for practice. Let us move to the next question. The next question which we are going to solve was asked in IBPS PO pre 2015. The statements are 1, 2, 6, 81, 88 and x okay as you can see that the difference is quite small here however the difference is more there so we should follow what logic should we follow 21 into 4 plus 4 is equal to 88 so something a and b are same okay here 6 into 3 plus 3 equal to 21 and both a and b are increasing so the rule can be 1 into 1 plus 1 equal to 2 2 into 2 plus 2 equal to 6 6 into 3 plus 3 equal to 21 and 21 into 4 plus 4 equal to 88 both a and b are same and both are increasing so what should be the next value 4 should be increased to 5 so you will get 88 into 5 plus 5 is equal to 445 as your solution option number d based on this you should try to solve this question these four more questions were asked in previous exam paper so what you should do you should solve all these seven questions and post your answers in the comment box okay now this is not the end of this type of problem we will discuss more type of problem which were discussed in the beginning of the of this lesson in the next video so don't forget to leave your comments and your solutions in the comment box if you like our video then do give us five star share our video to your on your on academy profile as well as on your facebook profile and on your on your social account so that more students can be benefited in the next video we will continue this part we will continue the part two which is also the most important type of questions where we will discuss some hard problems based on this type of questions so if you want to get notified by any video which i upload then do follow me on unacademy.com user bankers ranker